Considering that about 43 million inpatient surgeries take place each year, there is a definite need for surgical technicians or surgical technologists. Additionally, it is said that hospitals are the most dangerous places to be. Now, this isn't because unhealthy people can be found there, but because infection kills more people than surgery. Keeping things sterile is one of the many duties of a surgical tech. This video will give you an idea as to what kind of an education is required to become a surgical technician and what your education might entail. Surgical techs are usually required to obtain a two-year degree, otherwise known as an associate's degree. Almost all hospitals, four-year colleges, community colleges and private colleges provide this type of education. Not only will you learn everything there is to know about the sterilization of tools and materials used in surgery, you'll also learn anatomy and physiology, microbiology, the fundamentals of surgical technology, you know, all those tools have names and purposes, and medical terminology. You will be required to earn a certificate and you will be required to take an examination to demonstrate what you've learned. Quite often, your training will include a type of residency or on-the-job training where you'll be under the supervision and guidance of a technician for a period of about six months. It is possible to receive this type of training by joining the military and many people opt for that path since, through the GI Bill, the military will, in this fashion, pay for your education. If you choose to go this route, you wouldn't just be working on soldiers, but often on the family members of those serving in the military, usually around the world, anywhere the United States has a military base. While you're in school, you'll be learning many things related to being a surgical tech. Whether you become a medical or a dental surgical tech, you'll be expected to have a good understanding of the injuries, illnesses and defects related to your field, as well as possess the knowledge for how to set up a plan for treatment for that condition. You will furthermore be expected to know something about psychology as people undergoing treatment or surgery may have emotional and even behavioural problems as a result of needing to undergo surgery. Almost all preparation programmes require their candidates to take classes in medical ethics. You'll need to know exactly how to set up an operating room and be ready to react on a moment's notice to any medical terminology thrown your way. There'll be no time for hesitation or uncertainty when you're working, so a certain amount of fortitude will be required of you. While this might all sound like much, it's important to remember that being a surgical technician is a demanding profession. Very often, people's lives will be at stake. That is, however, the purpose of a good education, to prepare you for anything you might face in that operating room. Please visit us at surgicaltechniciansalarydata.com for more information on surgical technician salaries and the training needed to get started in this exciting and lucrative career field.